Yes, you do. Hi, everybody. I'm recording. This is Shelly Weeks, and um, it is, what's the date, guys? July 11th. 11th. July 11th. 7-11. 7-11. Let's go get Slurpees. Um, <laughs> and uh, super excited to just um, uh, powwow with you tonight. Um, we did our virtual team meeting on our team page earlier. We're recording this so that uh, if there's any gems and wisdom that um, that uh, folks who are missing this meeting want to catch up on, they can watch and um, as we recap today's meeting. So we've got um, some new faces and some familiar faces. Not everybody knows each other. I know Carrie and Rosario are going to be in um, pop in here shortly. They are brand new, as well as Michelle who ordered her kit. Today's Thursday. I want to say it was Tuesday. Yes? I think it was. Yes. July 9th is your official anniversary date. It will always be a, a wonderful date to keep track of. So, Michelle, welcome. And um, you get to introduce first. Tell us where you are and how long you've been a pamper chef and what you're <laughs> about. New girl on the block. Okay. I <clears throat> live in Clayton, California, and not far from Shelly. And Shelly, I, I had stuff in a folder called Pampered Chef from about 20 years ago. And Shelly's name was on it. And her last name was Valette. And, wow. I, and when you came to my house and did a Pampered Chef party, I still didn't realize that I knew you already. Honestly. So <clears throat> when I. I, I, I didn't know that. Yes, and so when she came to my house and did a live party, I've, I have Pampered Chef stuff from 30 years ago, and I still had it, and I had got a lot of old stuff, and she was telling me what had been revamped. Um, I have vintage things that aren't sold anymore, <laughs> so I have a ton of Pampered Chef gadgets and gizmos. So that's great. And so what was, what was the impetus to get you to join up and sign up? What well, I have my own business and, um, I'm extremely busy. I, um, process evictions. So I work for a lot of landlords, a lot of realtors and property managers, and I am a paralegal, but I do all the paperwork. I work with an attorney and it's really busy. Um, but I'm going to be 63 next week, next week, Sunday, and I have to start winding down. I need to retire soon or I want to, and because I can't keep up this pace forever. And I'm thinking, I love to cook. I do, a, um, I'm in charge of the happy meals. I call them for my church. So if somebody has a baby, if somebody's in the hospital, if somebody has cancer, um, I'm in charge of coordinating meals for them. So I have a lot of cooker friends, little foodies. I have a lot of foodie friends. Well, when, so, when, when we you know, out in a jar party, I mean, they were coming out of the woodworks. They were loving it. So Yeah, the jar party they liked. Awesome. Uh, outstanding. Right. So you're thinking this can uh, segue into your, your fun job. For In my time. retirement. Right. I mean, I'm, I may not, I, I'm going to do the best I can to kick it off and get it going, but um, I have limited time because it gets crazy, especially about, I don't know, anywhere from the 6th through the 15th of the month when people don't pay the rent, uh, yeah. okay. you know? Well, give oh. applause for Michelle, who's the newest Pampered Chef, but she also just finished a really awesome online party. She was the host, and she used $50 of her host rewards to discount the, um, the kit. She got the little kit, $59 kit, so awesome. And I really went into this because I wanted that ice cream maker. <laughs> I've always wanted an ice cream maker, and they're all so expensive. Yeah, yeah, no. With everybody awesome. licking the ice cream at the ice at this grocery store, you want to make your own. That's a great. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. They're doing that viral on Facebook or something, right? Oh, yeah. oh I saw a picture with uh, police officers or security guards stationed outside of the cold food 
display at the, oh my gosh, you're right, Kate. Kate, will you please introduce yourself to all these folks? Nope. Come on. Everybody <laughs> knows Kate. <laughs> I'm Kate McGuire and I live in South Jordan, Utah. I used to live in Concord where, of course, I met Shelly, yes. the awesome Shelly. And uh, I joined six years ago. It was June. I kept saying the 30th. It was the 26th. But who cares? It was June. And it was, six it was years June. Ago. So happy sixth anniversary to Kate. Thank you. Oh, you. So <laughs> Love it. What are we, you should do, we should do something like, uh, you know, how it's paper for the first anniversary. And we should I do mean, something like that. That would be fun. I, food choppers for the sixth. Yes. Food <laughs> chops for the 10th. Yeah, yeah. that's that's awesome. We need, that's a great idea. That's a great idea. Um, Carol hopefully will join us. She's celebrating her fourth anniversary almost at the exact same time as Kate. And then we had um, Sharon of one year anniversary. So I, um, I have access to these reports. I'm like, oh my gosh, look at all the anniversaries. That was so exciting. What are and you who's on the far right? It just we're, says we're iPhone and no name. Oh, okay. We're going to go around in a second. So Kate, oh. um, what are you most excited about, Kate? I know what you're most excited about. Come on. Conference. National <laughs> conference. Awesome. So yes. we're going to be, um, oh, wow, I just hit my goal for the day. Um, we're going to be going to Rosemont, Illinois together. And how many times have you been to national conference, Kate? This will be my third because I dug in my heels the first couple of years and I thought Shelly was just talking about another noisy bunch of people. No, And then I went <laughs> I went, and I'm so glad I did, and I'm going every year now from here on out. Awesome, awesome. I'm so proud of you. Great, great job. Excellent. And then right next to Kate is Patrice. Michelle, can you see Patrice? I can. Hi, Patrice. Hi, Patrice. Hi. Tell us where you're calling in from. I am in Magnolia, Delaware. In Where's that? <laughs> All the way on the other coast. Yes. And it's 9.15. For Here, D.C., right? Yeah. Probably. Yeah. A few hours from there. Great. Okay. What, yeah. um, how long have you done Pamper Chef? And what are you most excited about, Patrice? Uh, I've been Pamper Chef a little over a year and a half. Joined December 31st, 2017 at 4 p.m. There's a story behind that. But <laughs> and I'm not actually in Shelly's team. I'm in um, Shaughnessy Owens's team. But... When Shaughnessy moved to California, they kind of hooked up and we, we I, adopted. We adopted Shaughnessy, and we're super. We're keeping her. We're keeping. <laughs> her. I don't care where they station um, him. There, we're not letting Shaughnessy go. Shaughnessy is promoting, <laughs> um, promoted uh, July first to a senior director, and she accomplished that by doing what I'm doing right now, which is going 150% online parties. And I'm seeing the results. There's three brand new Pampered Chefs with us right this minute as a result of that. And that's what Shaughnessy's got a six month head start and oh my gosh, they're awesome. So Patrice, we're super glad you're here. Thank you. What are you most excited about? Oh, I am looking forward to conference. conference. I went last year and I had a blast. My husband didn't want me to go this year because I have not been doing much, especially since I was sick this spring. And I'm like, I'm going anyway because it's a lot of fun. And hopefully <laughs> it, it will get me going, especially with all these changes on Facebook and the business. I haven't started my business page yet. Oh. I, I did the webinar last night and I will get that done. There's a lot of great support for it. See what happens. Great. I can't wait to see you again, Patrice. That'll be marvelous. And I'm so glad that Rosario just popped in. Rosario, can you hear us okay? Yes. There she is. So Rosario is ordering her kit. I'm hoping in about half an hour, as soon as we're done, boom, she'll be um, signing on and become official. So um, welcome, welcome. Uh, Rosario finished up, you finished up your online party just, I mean, we're finishing it today. Yep. Yes. So Tell us where you are and what you're um, most excited about. Well, I uh, live in Oakland mm -hmm. and I'm very Ooh. excited <laughs> about everything. About everything. <laughs> awesome. How was your party or what, what motivated you to join in Pampered Chef? You and I have been cooking together for, I want to say three plus years. You've been. Yes. A, so what I've asked you again and again, what finally did the trick? 
I need a new pot. <laughs> you need a new pot and pan. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Ice cream maker. Pots and pans. Oh. So I need to upgrade my pans, and I, I turn to Chelly. <laughs> Well, there's a double burner grill pan incentive for getting started this month. So do what I tell you to do. Basically, just do what I tell you to do. And uh, you guys clear out, you know, you'll be ready to have that double burner grill pan uh, for free. And how, how much, what value is that? That's a very fun. That's a lot of money. It's like a $200 pan, if not more. Anybody know? I think it was yeah. like $269. It, it's mm, yeah and it's beautiful so um i love it and actually i think we got you a double burner grill pan when we did your last party and every time i turn around she's messaging me and saying guess what i made guess what i made guess what i made so um <laughs> rosario has from the party that's finishing today she has at least three if not more um folks who are who want to do online parties they all start next friday so we're going to be teaching her how to do that and um and one of them does not speak English at all so oh okay combination of the translator in facebook and also um we have like michelle and carrie saw um kate even when um we've done these online parties i have templates for them and so um i just basically hand you my templates and teach you how to use it and she's going to do some translating and then she will have that template to be able to use and reuse and reuse. So Hi. Um, awesome. So we'll have a, a Si me necesitas Rosario, yo hablo español. Gracias. Okay. <laughs> Work for me. Work for me. Welcome Rosario. I'm so glad you're here. Laurel, I'm going to call on you next. Can you hear us okay and can you sh shout out um, and introduce yourself real quick? Looks like she's on mute is muted yeah i'm i messaged and, and she there said we go. Go. There, there she is laurel introduce yourself tell us where you are, yeah. are you? <laughs> i am in well i'm actually today i'm in mountain view missouri but normally i'm in west plains today i'm farm sitting um 14 dogs a herd of goats horses cows oh goodness not, like donkeys so if something starts barking a lot, that's me. That's the one. That's what we were hearing. Okay, Dash, are you there? Yep. Great. What's um? How long have you been a pamper chef, and what are you most excited about? Well, I'm really excited about going to conference and learning some some tricks and tips, awesome. especially on how to manage my time better. Um, because like right now, I'm really really busy with all this farm sitting, and not home. Right. So it's really hard for me to reach out to people, especially the week where I had no phone service whatsoever where I was. Yeah. Wow. Well, you Is know, it because it was so rural or was something the matter? Yeah. I mean, I had an internet. <clears throat> no, it was very, it's very, very rural. Right. Um, I had limited internet service. It was on satellite and the satellite kept going out. But at least I felt, you know, worst case scenario, I knew somebody down the road. So in case of an emergency, I was going to run down the road and use their um, landline phone. <laughs> but it was a little exciting. That's a little more rural than I like to be. Gotcha. I'm so excited for you going to your very first national conference. It's going to be so cool to watch you watch national conference and experience it. Super jazz for you, hon. And, I think and I'm about a month away from my anniversary. Oh, okay. Your anniversary, one year? My one year anniversary, I think, is in August. It's either the first of September or the last of August, Got I it. think. That's fabulous. <laughs> Very good. And um, Laurel is on whose team? Now you can put me on. The, um, Darcy recruited Darcy. me, so, Darcy, so go Carol. backwards from there. <laughs> yeah, Carol is your director, and then I'm Carol's director. So um, you are like my grandma. Okay grandchild right I'm your great grandmother I like that I like being somebody's grandchild there you go very good I, <laughs> every time I'm at national conference and I see these ladies I, across the stage with um promoting to different levels and they're in their little Mennonite dresses and hats or they're Amish or and I think about Laurel saying I've got no cell service I'm like they have no cell phones electricity vehicles 
phones, computers, and they're promoting in levels. Yes, but and they have a large community. Yes. See, that's what I'm missing. I'm missing the community. Well, we've uh, we've got community, and we'll yeah. So that's your focus. That's your focus. Is make friends with the Amish girls, and <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my focus is. Actually, my focus is to get out of my um, chair and actually do something. Okay, there you go. Um, there you part of it was I was uh, I've been I've been sick all spring, so that didn't help either. All right. Well, um, but now that I'm well, yeah, I can relate to that. Yay! Well, I'm glad you're here. Thank you, Miss Laurel. And if you have to mute because you have um, barnyard stuff going welcome. on, we get that. We get that. Um, I'm gonna well, yes, I'm definitely going to mute myself again. Okay, that's great, as long as you can hear us. I'm gonna to bounce to Carrie, who's been waiting patiently. You popped in, Carrie. Can you turn on your, um, what is it called? Your um, video. Camera so we can see your lovely face and say hi to you. you I'm, not, I'm not sure how to do that. But <laughs> no worries. So probably, you're on your side. Uh, if you kind of oh, right here, okay, I think. Uh, there I am. There she is, good job. I, I am so excited to introduce you guys to Carrie. Carrie has a two week head start on Michelle and Rosario, and she is running her business from her cell phone. I'd have her hold it up, except she's actually communicating with us on it. This I'm really on it. <laughs> it's not the newest of cell phones, and she is it's so terrible. freaking excited and committed to make this work to get a new tell us what you're going to use all these this income for miss carrie um i'm going to restart my whole entire life um from scratch basically so yeah i need a, a phone i need a computer i need a car and a place to live so yeah you're in the right place so, um, so excellent yeah no pressure, but I can't fail. No. <laughs> <laughs> Even our first plan uh, is to do, have her do a Pamper Jeff fundraiser to the phone fund to upgrade her cell phone. That's the plan for the first fundraiser. Um, tell us where you are and um, what you're most excited about, Carrie. Um, right now I'm in Manteca, California. Um, I mean, I'm just excited about everything, you know, <laughs> so, um, I was invited to a party and I had such a great time. I just thought I would just stick with it. <laughs> That's true. So, yeah. Actually, yeah. You, you attended one of my first on my first online party. Um, Tommy was the host and then she held her own and took the bookings and it's run off from run from there. So, um, we're, we're excited to help you get going, hon. Thank you so much. Who else just came in? Miss Annette, uh -huh. how are you? I'm doing all right, trying to stay cool. Ah, where are you? Where are I'm you? in Gilbert, Arizona, where the high today was 110. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh. But, it's a, but it's a dry heat. Oh, stop. <laughs> for, about, for about two weeks, then monsoon's coming. It's a whole nother story. Ooh, there we go. There we go. And we just uh, waved to her as we went by the um, last pamper chef, free pamper chef vacation was in, in Scottsdale, which is the neighboring town next to Annette. Well, it's like, it's about 30 miles from me. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Versus it's 3,000. So. Oh, I've been yeah. there. It's pretty in Scottsdale. It, yeah. Like, Gilbert's all the spas okay. are over there. Yeah. Yeah. Gilbert, Gilbert is more farm community, but it's basically a bedroom farm community. <laughs> it's, it's the Tracy of the phoenix area <laughs> <laughs> how long have you been a pampered chef in it and what are you most excited about i have been a pampered chef customer since what did i say uh 93 but i've been a consultant since 2010 Ooh. um i have way way more stuff than i need but you know hey it's pampered chef so um <laughs> And I am most excited about getting to see you all at conference. But, you know, and that's, to be honest, that's why I like to go to see the people and find out what you guys are up to. And you know, the bonus is the, the getting to find out of products. Yeah. Oh my gosh, the new products. Yeah, the word on the street was be sure you wear socks, they're going to get knocked off. 
And uh, that was <laughs> from the top. That was straight from Sherry Carr, who knows of what she speaks. There's a bunch of new announcements that um, there's at least like three super major off the charts announcements. <coughs> and uh, so we will we will be sharing as soon as we hear. And um, it's a very exciting time. Annette, I'm so glad you're going to go. And you and Kate get to room with Ellen, right? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Gosh, that is going to be party central. We're going to actually bring the party to your room. Is that okay? Yeah. Sure. So one night during the national conference, we um, we have a delivery of Giordano's uh, traditional deep dish Chicago pizza. They have bring us pizza, oh. and salad, and Carol brings wine, and uh, and we do a, a, a networking. So as you're going through conference for those first couple of days, it's going to be the Thursday night, and we get there on Tuesday, Wednesday. Um, you can invite folks to join us for that for that evening, and um, that way we learn from everybody. That's how we met Brenda last year. Brenda brought her team, and we just we were networking and sharing. And I just kind of created a, a a space where everybody could share what they were learning, and it was it was monstrously huge. It was so cool. So. Um, <laughs> So for those of you who are not going to national conference, hi, Laurel, there she is. Um, if you're not going to national conference, you want to be paying, number one, you want to be doing everything to fill your calendar because they make announcements at new national conference that will impact the month of August. So national conference is the tw July 24th to the 27th. And then they'll make some announcements about that will, will, you'll be able to put into place for August and you're going to want to have parties for August. August is the last month of our spring summer catalog. And everybody's really looking forward to September where the new products launch September 1st. But you do not want to skip August. Number one, the bonuses in August are outrageous. Super, super cool. Who knows what the host and guest bonuses, or at least the host bonus is for August. Who knows? I think it's 60% off anything they want to choose in the catalog. Hello, they do that maybe once, twice a year. So right now, I, I mean, Michelle was super jazz um, and Rosario. Yeah, my ice cream maker. You got your ice cream maker, but I had hosts who were like, uh, mm, that's not on my list. I, they weren't stoked over a 60% off ice cream maker. Right now, the grills, the grilling tools are 60% off in July, and that's great if you want grilling tools. But you go August, and they can pick anything. I mean, picture a knife block set at 60% off. Or one of those croc rocks. The croc rocks or rock crocs or whatever they're called. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Rosario, did you, um, you've got a story about rock crocs. You just experienced, uh, just learned about them, huh? Yeah. What are, which one are you getting? I'm getting the um, the one with the base, and I'm getting the base, and I actually want the the smaller size. I don't want the everyday pan, which the is everyday pan. Very good one. They both fit in that slow cooker base. Excellent. And um, so you could um, you're you're picking yours for half off. Oopsie. Oh, my kitten is about yes. to on me. Uh, <laughs> but um, the sixty percent off is even my off? grill pan. In your grill pan, yeah. Actually, so, uh, that's going to be my son's grill pan. She, she's <laughs> gifting her <laughs> her sixty percent off choice to her son. How sweet! <laughs> Ooh, that's great. Okay, so you guys all, um, did you all get a chance to um, scroll through and see the posts that we did for our team meeting earlier today? Yeah. And um, just to kind of take. A, that's okay, Michelle. You can still do it. I worked up until like past six so I'm like oh yeah and yeah. that's why, whether it's a virtual meeting which we did today or a virtual or online party Is that on messenger or Facebook so it's on our Facebook team page okay got it I have to go into groups and the Facebook it. team page yes and um, so real quick, not real quick, but who wants to go first? What was something that you saw during those posts where they went between one and four o'clock today that you didn't know that you were super glad to have learned? Nothing. You guys knew all of it. I'm, I'm glad they're still there because I haven't had a chance to see them. <laughs> There's that. There's that. I have to figure out how I get in there. 
I can get in there. Does anybody else need to know how to get to our team page? Because I can share my screen and, sh and we, I can scroll through them. Shall I do that? Was, it, was the sure. was that focus group, right? Nope, nope. You're looking at Messenger on Facebook. Okay, I'm going to share my screen and I'm going to open up Facebook and we're going to see what's look, what Facebook is looking like over here. Okay, here's Facebook and I'm going to go, I'm going to close my things. I'm talking to Rosario. I'm talking to all these people. If I'm at home on Facebook, all right, then right. that's great. <laughs> okay, never mind. So I type in, I type in team on the search field. And it's team Weeks. My last name is Weeks. Ellen's last name, she's, she's our director. Ellen Lowe and Carol Keen. So Weeks Lowe Keen rock stars. That's the name of our page right here. And when I click on that, we always have this banner up at the top where we're tracking what we're who's who's got sales and recruits for the month. Um, but this is our page right here. So it's a it's a group, Michelle, not um, not messenger. Right, right. I'm in there now. Okay. And then as you scroll through this is across the front of uh, the top. This is across right. the top. Yep. Okay, everybody know how to get there? Yep. Yeah. This is one of the greatest yeah. resources for you. I can't tell there you. We I resisted Facebook as a general thing. I resisted Facebook and I've been a pampered chef. Oh, by the way, I'm Shelly. I'm in Concord, California. I am celebrating my 19th anniversary this month, right after national conference. And, um, I am super excited about, about online parties. I can't tell you how excited I am. They have just exploded and I've only really been doing them for a month. And I'm super stoked because there's, I've got three new teammates who are here who are helping us do them and a lot of growth actually. But um, as you look through here, um, you will find news about this meeting right now. So that's pinned up at the top. I just, 27 minutes ago, I just posted about how to get into the Zoom call. You're on right this minute. But if you scroll down, oh, and there's a welcome to Rosario. Brand new <laughs> I see it. Trujillo. Yep. Got it. Yes. Trujillo. Am I saying it right? Trujillo. Trujillo. Beautiful. So as you're looking at the posts from the meeting today, they're numbered. So if you haven't seen them yet and you want to go sequentially and see them in order, <laughs> use this little search bar right there. See that little tiny place right there? Mm -hmm. And they're called there. It's P O S T space one, two, three, etc. So type in post one and hit enter. And here's post one posted five hours ago. Click that. And there's post number one. Welcome to our July virtual meeting. Okay. And so that's a welcome. Okay. Very good. So post number two. And we've got we're doing all kinds of, um, so you can just really, you can go through this one by one. And I saved, um, I said, there's a bunch of celebrations for our team anniversaries and milestones. Those are at the end, but you can just go sequentially through those posts. So, um, any, did anything jump out at you or did anything generate any questions for those of you who have gone through this already? Yeah, there's something that's going to become, Watch this space for July 16th and then for the 29th. Some new stuff that's coming up. Right. Do you know which post that one's on, Kate? No, I don't remember which number. Let me see. Oh, you're sharing your screen, so I can't look. Hi, Kate. Hi. <laughs> July. Uh, big news submitting sales. It's What's like uh, in, in there with the... Uh, this month's specials, I think. Okay. So I don't know offhand which post it was. If you guys find it, let me know. But um, so yeah, there are, there are some extra, well, actually, I think it had to do with, didn't Sherry tell us, Sherry tell us about the bag. Yeah, she, she did, but it wasn't in that post. It it's, wasn't in that one. Okay.
there. Yeah, sure. Yeah, I'm not sure which one it was, Kate. No, I'll find it and I'll. Okay, good deal. So um, as you're looking through there, um, anybody, so um, there's a couple announcements coming up. July 16th, I think, is one. And so they've got some extra incentives for us. That's what I was talking about. Yeah. And there's so, a new incentive on the 16th and then the new consultant incentive on the 29th. Learn more on July 16th. So um, this Weekender bag that says Pampered Chef, it's all stitched in. And can you guys see that? Is that gorgeous or what? Yeah, I've, I've got it on my phone. Yeah, yeah. That's, you guys can earn <clears throat> It is only July seven hundred and fifty dollars of sale. Fifty, yeah. Between the two parties that I closed, um, that I closed today, totaled well over that. That was basically a week's worth of online parties, um, one or two parties typically, and you'll get that bag. And folks who are going to national conference also get this one, which is super cool. Does and everybody get that one? Yes, yes. Just by, you'll pick it up at conference. Awesome. Cool. What was that? Cool. Cool, I agree. Super cool. Yeah, you're going to have people coming up to you in the grocery store. Woo mm -hmm. awesome. mm -hmm. And you get a paycheck, which is even more excellent. Um, okay, any other, and this basically, we do this, um, we do this kind of debriefing after our after the morning where we post the um the content all the posts for our online meeting for the month and it's a chance for you guys to to ask each other questions if you're struggling with anything in particular or to share if you've had successes um but so we'll just start with questions. Has anybody run into any like major obstacles or questions or things you're stuck on and you want to get some ideas from, you know, we've got a wealth of, of experience here on this call right now. Anybody have any questions they need help on? I have a quick question. Laurel, go for it. Um, you said there's a, cons a new consultant bonus something coming out about the 29th of this month. Kate, Kate's looking. I am recruiting my niece, my great niece. Oh, awesome! I have a party at her place in Wisconsin on the on the twentieth. I think it is. It's a weekend before conference. Wow. See, I'm double dipping. I'm doing a party right before conference, about mm, six hundred miles away. <laughs> nice for me. Um, so my question is: Should I wait till that Come announcement on. to sign her up, or go ahead and get her signed up? Oh, well, that's a good question. So, so I don't know. Um, I don't know if the announcement is about people who are um, getting signed this month or not. But regardless, okay. it, it's something probably that's going to affect all consultants. And if you wait to the end of the month to sign her, she won't have the whole benefit of this time to get her feet under her and get okay. So that my, okay. my guideline is always, you know, get, get them going because they need, um, uh, you know, as much time as possible. Um, when I got started in okay. August, but I took three full months to think about it before I finally said, okay, I'll do it. I so wished I'd started in April when I started exploring Pampered Chef. But she had a virtual party with another consultant um, a couple months ago. It did not go well. Okay. Um, I think I was the only person who ordered. I'm not positive on that, mm -hmm. um, but I was nice and put in an order under my brother's name um, for her. But I know she didn't make her goal because she was trying to qualify as a consultant at that point. And I know she didn't make her goal to, to, to get her kit paid for or partially paid for or whatever, whatever the current incentive was. Right. So that's why I'm, wishy-washy about when to sign her up. Okay, well, I get that. So whenever she starts, that she will have a full month of um, earning the new consultant rewards, whatever that is, and then she'll have 90 days, mm -hmm. 90 days. Kathy McCready is, yes. is one of our newer consultants. Her 90th day was this week, and she earned over 
600, I think $600 in PC dollars and bonuses over that three months. So, um, when well, I've got a feeling Selena's going to do very, very well at this because she has a large extended family in the area. Awesome. That's terrific. I found it, Kate. Okay, so there is a July 29th new consultant promotion, which I imagine it affects um, August, uh, but I don't know for sure. We will find out. And then on the 16th, it's a sales pr promotion for us. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, as well as all the additional announcements from National Conference. Mm -hmm. So, um, so Laurel, I know, yeah, you, what you want to do is connect with Carol and um, strategize with Carol about getting her signed up and make sure that three of you have a conversation and have your, um, your niece start booking parties so that when she does sign up, boom, she's got some parties ready to go. Okay. All right. Cool. Okay. Congratulations. That will make you see your consultant. Love it. Who else has questions? Carrie, how are your parties going? Do you have questions that you need help with? I need new people. <laughs> so my is just lagging so bad. I can't even believe it. They already canceled once, and then we rescheduled, and now they're flaking on me again. <laughs> okay, and I'm doing fantastic. <laughs> yeah, that's all right. That's all right. So um, you. Uh, that's why we, you know, you book as many as possible, and it's a totally normal thing right. to have cancellations and overbook so um we'll get we'll get your feet under you we'll get your feet under so you. so carrie where where in manteca are you i'm right off the freeway next to the bass pro shop <laughs> okay because i used to live in tracy so um oh, okay we should talk <laughs> we should talk because i might have some some people who can help you so oh, awesome because Annette moved okay. out of California, so you so you're um, you probably have customers who want live parties, right, Annette? Right, exactly. Exactly. So yeah. So I know of one for sure. Okay. So we'll talk. <laughs> awesome, awesome. Very good. Kit arrived a couple days ago, so she's ready. Awesome. In fact, you know what? Um, you got your spiralizer, right? And what you you were watching that video? What happened with your mom? You were. Uh, you were watching the video of me doing the cookware? What happened? I was watching the pan video. Um, I was watching the pan video. I had my headphones on, so my mom couldn't hear the, her, uh, couldn't hear Shelly talking about it. But when she saw that Shelly could take the handles off of those pans so neatly, she was just super impressed, and now she wants those pans. <laughs> So I'm trying to convince her to host a party. <laughs> awesome. Easy. So right now she's making her list. <laughs> making a big list. Oh, great. That's yeah. That's <laughs> yep. um, so, and you talked about having um, folks at the church. So you've got some leads that are going to start to pop on you here. I love it. Yeah. And also her neighbor came over last night and never heard of Pampered Chef. So... Now she has. <laughs> now she has, and she's like, "Oh my gosh!" And <laughs> so <laughs> that's outstanding. Yeah, very, very cool. I love it. Um, so, are do you guys know which pan video Carrie's talking about? I don't. Okay. No, I don't. Um, so I had two online parties this week, and Monday, um, the they were chatting in the online party on Facebook. And they were asking questions about the nonstick cookware versus the stainless and which do you, you know, which one do I want? What do you use them for? And I told them in the beginning of the online party, if you've got questions, let me know. I'll pop in via Facebook live. I just pull things out of my cupboard and open up my phone and I'll show you how it, um, I'll kind of give you the pros and cons. And um, I'm looking to see, I think I've got a message from, got it. Uh, and Kathy, the one who just celebrated her 90th day and with $600 in PC dollars, was here that afternoon. So I said, Kathy, I'm going live with the cookware. So she stood there and she kept asking me questions as I was talking about the, the pans. And I report, I did it live into the virtual party. And there's a way that you can, you can copy that video, you download it to your computer and save it. 
and then I uploaded it into Rosario's party. And Rosario, your friends were watching it and talking about it too. And so they wanted cookware. And then I put it on our team page, which is where Carrie saw it and her mother watched her over her shoulder. So my point being, you guys can use me did that little video talking about cookware and you can share it with your folks and say, mm -hmm. you know, look how awesome cookware is. You don't have to go record it in your own kitchen. You can just share the one that I did. And, and that's, you know, feel free to. And when you post it, if you post it into a party or anything, just say, Hey, my friend Shelly pulled her, all the cookware out of her cupboards and kind of explained the difference between them. And here she is showing it in one of her parties. So it doesn't matter that I'm talking about my host Renee and her friends and whatnot. It and that Kathy's standing there. You can still use that. Okay. Um, there's a special way to download it so that you can then upload it again. And if someone wants to know how to do that, post it in our team page, and I'll post the instructions on how to do it because it's not necessarily a, it's not just a copy and paste kind of thing. Okay. Thanks for sharing that. Any <laughs> other questions or things you guys, we've got some new folks here. Well, you, know, to, you know, a big thing about all these pans, mm -hmm. remember Shelly, I had some Pampered Chef, like um, nonstick cookware, like a saute, like a big saute pan and a small one. Yeah. And I had them for years and they got really yucky. I needed you new ones. And you said, oh, they'll replace those for you. Yeah. And we sent, I don't know how we, but I sent them back or I did something and I got brand new pans. After, and I'm not kidding. I had those things probably over 10 years. Oh my gosh. And you know, it's just the cost of putting them in a box and sending them back to Pamper Chef, right? Yeah, yep. it was nothing. Yeah. That's, that's what a lifetime warranty is for. <laughs> you know what? I think they sent me labels. Uh, I printed the labels off. I didn't even have to pay the shipping. So if you'd had them less than 30 days, mm -hmm. yes, Pamper Chef will, um, will pay the shipping after that. Oh, well, I don't remember the shipping hurting because it was no big shakes. Great. I'm I got brand new pans. Awesome. I'm so glad to hear you say that because um, I have occasionally people like, I'm glad I have to send it back. Like, are you kidding? It's, it's super, super easy to do. So um, I love that. And yeah, cookware knives, lifetime guarantee. Yep. Very good. All right. Who else? Questions or, oh my gosh, wow. Things that you've learned about Pampered Chef that you need everybody to know. Guess what I'm doing here? I was out all day long. And since there are not a lot of comments on, um, on the, um, on the uh, meeting, I'm putting tickets in for each of you and I'm gonna do the drawing here as soon as we're, as soon as we're done. Alrighty. Yes, Shelly, I wanted to, to share that, um, I think Patrice, you said you were on the webinar last night? Yes. Yeah, me too. It was awesome. Was it? So yeah. much information. What but was the topic? Um, the fundamentals of Facebook. Okay. And yeah. and um, her name is Danny. She will be at the Tech Cafe. Um, and she also said that there's going to be four um, articles. I don't know if there's videos or, or just what, but there's going to be articles in the stir. There's going to be four of them, okay. I guess, sequentially, that will have all that information in it anybody who missed it okay and it was yeah, really good yeah i sat in on it too it was good oh good um any specific like can you pull out a single example and share with us like what was the one of the oh my gosh wows oh so many things and i don't have my notes in front of me but one thing that um and i think i mentioned to you some previous conversation we had about how to link your business page in your groups she talked about how to do that she yep. talked about the basics of setting up a business page. I mean, she went right down the line about you can put in your phone number if you want to, but, but she wouldn't, she says, don't put in your street address. You can put in your zip code, yeah. but you know, so she was being, she's real specific. Shared the cautious part of it too. The safety part of keeping yourself safe. 
So Carrie and actually Kathy has been asking me about her business page and I had Carrie set one up and then set up her first virtual parties, her first online parties inside of her business page. And she's like, I don't know what to do with my business page. Like, it doesn't matter. Just set it up and then put the parties in mm -hmm. and, um, and we'll, we'll construct it from, you know, going forward. But so Carrie paid close attention. Those emails are called stir. And you can actually, Kate, do you know if they recorded the call? Are they going to? They recorded. They did record them. She wasn't sure whether the evening one or the afternoon one was going to be the one that will be on the site. But said it would probably take a, a few days, but it will be linked Super. to the, uh, the main website. Super. That's great. All right. I there was it. one thing that, that just popped into my head, and maybe you can help you remember the details, Patrice, um, about whether you, you need it, it. The profile on your business page needs to be your profile on your personal page so that you can direct people so that, that they know who, who you are and who you're talking to, talking about or who's doing, who's doing the posting or something like that. She means the profile picture. The picture needs to be the same? Well, no, um, um, it's the same email address for yeah. both. Okay. But she I think it was from your Pampered Chef website picture oh. and uh, your personal page oh, should be the same. So people going around town might recognize you. Oh, go, oh you're the Pampered Chef lady. Oh, cool. And you might want to have a, a more professional looking one on the business page. Yeah. Okay. There you go. She also talked about interacting uh, at, in parties as your page or as your personal self. What did they recommend? As the page. Interesting. Because I just recently started doing this and you can bounce back and forth. So it'll mm -hmm. be like posting as Shelly or posting as cooking classes with Shelly. And depending on which one you use to set up the, the groups, it gives you different... Um, ability to edit and, and you know do things to the group and so I have to bounce back and forth so I've, I've noticed that um, it would be good to have the pictures be the same so that when you do move back and forth you're not confusing the guests in a party who is this other person no they're the same people they're the same person right right yeah lots of little tips like that it was just chock full of stuff I mean I'm gonna have to go back and listen to it and watch stir for all the the um, articles that they put in about it and everything too. Yeah. I, I've not been using my business page okay. to post my parties in it. Yeah. And yeah. I actually, while I was listening to it, I, I was at work, so I used my phone to, to do a vocal record so oh. I could listen to it at least, okay. uh, you know, without having to get to a computer because I couldn't be at a computer, you know, some of the time, so. Yeah. Well, they, I mean, aren't you just so impressed at the, the resources and the, the support that Pampered Chef gives us? I mean, there's been all this wackiness with Facebook that's completely out of our control. Facebook is making changes and apparently there's more coming. Mm -hmm. um, and that's fine and good, but, um, you know, Pampered Chef has done everything possible to give us, give us support and help us so that we're, we, we're, armed and dangerous and out there, you know, share, sharing and um, able to, to use this platform. And then there's, there's others too. I mean, you don't want to put all your eggs in one basket. Does anybody share their business on Twitter or Pinterest or Instagram, Snapchat, YouTube? We were talking about YouTube with, um, uh, was it Michelle I was talking with about YouTube? I was talking with somebody who was um, uh, doing uh they're do do you know making a channel on youtube for their customers with these videos and things that are specifically attached to them and um so that's a great i mean these are free platforms and it's social media which means it can really explode um there's a new consultant on our team named mary and she's new with pampered chef but prior to pampered chef she ran an entire personal business with up to 12,000 customers on Twitter. Just, wow. Yes. So you need to jot down Mary. Mary's her name. And um, 
uh, make friends with Mary and quiz her because I'm I'm still trying to get so that you and I can talk about it and I can uh, kind of quiz her on um, how she did that because that's something I want to do. You know, we don't want to we don't want to be so focused on Facebook and then have Facebook make a change that completely messes everything up, right? And you have to relearn. Right. Yeah. So um, diversify. Multifaceted. Yeah. Michelle, what? I said multifaceted. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. Lots of different mediums. Yeah. And there's people who eat <laughs> on all of those mediums and as well as your neighbors, right? Who was it who, um, I think it was Kathy, uh, got an invitation to a pampered chef party from a friend yeah. who didn't know she did pamper chef. The gal was hosting a pamper chef party and invited Kathy to come as a, as a guest. So you want to make sure all your neighbors and everybody knows that you do pamper chef and make sure they know it multiple times. And um, I had that happen to me once, but the person knew I did pamper chef. Well, that, that was a situation. That was a situation with Kathy. She was a little burned because, like, come on, you knew that I was doing this, right? And the girl's like, "Oh, I forgot." Yeah, yeah. Uh, Shelly. Yeah. Salty. That's a bit salty. <laughs> Who was asking me a question, Rosario? Oh, uh, so I wanted to mention that you guys could post on your. Uh, sorry, that's an alarm. Um, you could post on Facebook. Um, your um business. Like on your um, bio. Yep. Um, that's what I'm. I'm just waiting to upload, so I can't wait to put Campus Chef on. <laughs> oh, so you yes, and in fact, you should have it. So on your Facebook profile, mm -hmm. you all want to make sure that your it says Pampered Chef in it, because there are uh, those of you who are brand new, my Michelles and my Rosarios. Um, don't realize yet, but there are a gazillion different groups to, that will support you in various areas that are consultant groups on Facebook. And they're super helpful, but there's a ton of them. And when you go to join one, the an admin is going to look at your profile to make sure you're a pampered chef. So yes, you do want to be sure that effective, as soon as we get off this call, you go into Facebook and update your profiles as, um, you know, that you're a consultant with Pampered Chef. What about LinkedIn? LinkedIn, I haven't gotten too much in, but yes, social media. Because, you know, I have a lot of people that look at my LinkedIn profile for my eviction business. Mm -hmm. And they could see that. Exactly. Could, you know, put the Pampered Chef thing in there and you never know. I mean, I'm, I deal with lots of realtors. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And realist, realtors like to give their new home buyers gifts. Yes. They do. <clears throat> and what's better than a basket with pampered chef? So if you post that on our team page and say, does anybody have any ideas for realtor gifts? You will get a slew of ideas. So here's your, your um, kind of a, a the thing to do is anytime you have an idea like that and you go, Oh wow, I can create gift baskets for realtors or I can make a flyer for this, that, or the other thing. Before you start doing it, post on her team page and say, does anyone have this already done? Uh, so you're not reinventing the wheel? Precisely. We are, that is, that is why I'm here after 19 years. I was a, uh, corporate. I, I'm a registered dietitian and I've been working my tail off in my corporate job. They would work me 60, 70 plus hours a week. They would fly me all over the country. My ex at the time, my husband at the time commented, you know, he knew when I came home from work at eight o'clock at night, don't look at me, get near me or anything. Give me a couple hours to debrief because to decompress. I was so stressed out and I had no control over that. We were trying to close on our house, this house, and I was pregnant, and I got laid off. Kind of, you know, that was the most stressful thing. I will never give anybody control over doing that ever, ever, ever again. So um, you, in this world, my point is, in this world of Pampered Chef and with our Pampered Chef family, everybody is wanting to help everybody else. When I help Michelle, I do better. When, when we bring in new people and help them thrive, we, that energy and that enthusiasm and that excitement lifts all of us up. 
and it's completely opposite in the corporate world. There's one spot for promotion and maybe 15 people going for it and they're clawing at each other and saving their good ideas and not sharing and they're not supporting each other. It's a right. different dynamic. And I will never, ever, ever go back. So Michelle, yes, before you recreate the wheel, ask, and you will have that, that Facebook page that I just showed you is your first go-to. You will soon learn that the Solution Center at Pampered Chef, they will bend over backwards to help you. All you have to do is call that toll-free number. And they'll be like, Michelle, hi, how are you? Oh, it's here brand new. What can I do to help you? It's remarkable. But our Facebook page and our family, our team, they are, they've got tons of info. And um, if you're stuck and you can't get a hold of your buddies or me or you need help, post on our team page and someone will reach out and help you. Can I share something, experience I just had with home office? Please. I had to call um, because one of my um, hosts didn't get something that she needed in her order. And so I called and I also had a tech question, but before the, um, what do you call them? Person who answers the phone. <laughs> Receptionist? The solution center, yeah. Solution center, thank you. Before she <laughs> sent me over, she helped me with the one issue, and then before she sent me over to tech, she said, are you coming to conference? And I said, well, yes, I am. And she says, oh, you have to come to the home office tour and come say hi to me. Oh, my name's God. Nanette. Come and stop by and say hi. Oh, my God. I mean, oh. just like, like we knew each other, which, of course, we never met, but right. it was but it awesome. feels like that, huh? And that is how they are. I mean, I have never had a bad experience calling. I've always been treated like I like they know me. And like home office. office is fantastic. Yes. yes. Yeah, absolutely fantastic. And we but are great. going on a home office tour. And this will and it's, it's phenomenal. You walk through all the offices and everything and they've got dry erase boards where you can write love notes and, and colorful things and they've got banners and they come out and they go, oh my gosh, look at their ear. And, you know, we get to tour through the, the warehouse and everything. So it is it is such a, an eye-opening thing to see what the processes are there. It's super open structure and nobody has closed office doors. I mean, even Doris's office and Jean's and, and they're all just right there next to Tracy and everybody's working on their stuff. It's a lot of collaboration, a lot of collaboration. Um, on National <coughs> for sharing. I just wanted to um, show you real quick. I posted this as one of the um, one of the posts. I saw that. Yeah. Yep. So this is we this will be the second year we're doing it, but it's a photo scavenger hunt and everybody oh. at the national conference gets one of these. So I'll have a hard copy for you. And it's got, you know, take your selfie with the home office staff or take a picture of yourself holding one of the new products and then they post their pictures on our team page from Chicago, from our national conference with the hashtag NC19, National Conference 19. So everybody who's home will be able to see in real time, you'll get all kinds of great pictures of, you know, of what's going on. And I will do a, um, a version of this for folks who are not going to conference so that you guys who are, if you're staying behind, you can, um, you can have your own photo scavenger hunt going on, you know, go and go and pamper a business and take a selfie of you taking a catalog into a business and, you know, things like that, that you can be working on, on your business while we're gone. And, uh, we will do, um, we'll do a, a parallel version of our photo scavenger hunt. Okay. Sound fun. Yeah. And if you're, if you're curious about national conference, go on our team page and use the search and search for hashtag NC 18 and scroll through pictures from last national conference and uh there's there's some seriously fun things in there so i want to thank all of you for coming and joining me and sharing and um and welcoming our new folks i'm super super excited for for um, our new people for our veterans every one of you no matter what level you do pamper chef you make our team remarkable and I give you such applause for the impact that you make on your friends and your family and your community and your neighbors and those who you touch by sharing Pampered Chef. It's to us, we, we appreciate having these tools in our kitchen to make our lives easier, but imagine what it would be if you did not have them. 
how challenging would it be? And <laughs> every impact that you make, I mean, for you gals who just hosted online parties, go, think back to the comments. There were people who said, we, the ones that we just finished up and the ones I finished last week, there are people who said, thank you so much for inviting me to this online party. I learned so much. I have such a big wish list now. There, I mean, they, you make an impact. You're helping people feed their family. And there's so many people who are struggling with that. So give yourselves a great big round of applause and keep sharing, keep sharing. Thank you, thank you for all you do. Now, I have some raffle tickets. Any last questions? Drum roll, please. We're gonna pull a raffle winner. I am going to pick a present. I will post it on our team page and ooh and ah and rave about that person and then put it in the mail. And you each have a ticket right in here. I'm super proud of you coming. I wish I could give all of you, make all of you winners. In fact, in my boat, you're all winners. We're just gonna have one present go to this person. And it says, can you see it? Trees. A tree. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, my dear. Thank, Thank you. you. Appreciate it. Absolutely. My pleasure. So I will um, connect with you to make sure I have a correct address and I will put a treat in the mail for you. And each of you go back to our um, team page and um, really study in and dive in and post comment or ask questions about each of those posts. Make, take advantage of it. Take advantage of the, the info that's there because there's some really, um, really important critical stuff there. And uh, yeah. let's have a fabulous rest of July and um, jam in into August. And that, when your July and August are super strong, your September is going to be stunning. Looking forward to it. Okay? Anything okay. <laughs> Love it. Thank you so much. I'm going to turn off the recording. I'm glad to have you guys all here.